Oh, it's Blarg. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Wait, imagine beatboxing a beat, having an echo back, and then rapping over that beat. <laughs> yeah. Hey. Okay. We ready. Oh, Blarg's fucking beat. That's leaking out his headset. I don't know where I was with headset. I'm a my own ad lib. Plantains. That was ass. I feel like if Billy Mays was still alive, he'd probably be like a SoundCloud rapper now or something. <laughs> with dreads. The gold tooth. He'd be OxyClean on the beat. <laughs> this beat is brought to you by OxyClean.com. Fresh beats. Monkey boy, are you having a good day? Uh, sure. Yeah, yeah. This guy sounds like he's like, there's a gun like in the back of his head. He sounds scared of you. You don't do math? I would ever do that. We might have to kick you from the team. A peer pressure man to doing it. Monkey boy, what if I told you I would PayPal you $1,000 to try methamphetamines? That, that's not, that's not good. <laughs> He's not easily influenced. I respect it. I'm like myself, dude. I'll suck it for a dollar. I'll do anything for two dollars in a cigarette butt. Just a butt of a cigarette? Yeah. A finished even... cigarette? <laughs> yeah, I just, just want to suck on the raft bar. bar. Oh. I want to suck the juices out. Oh! oh! <laughs> was that you sucking the juices out? <laughs> or was that you getting your juices sucked out? I couldn't tell. <laughs> I like Tuesday that whenever you go back later. on this game, you just like revert to the same noises you made three years ago. <laughs> bunger? Bunger? No, uh, Bunger you was just like... Bu you just bungered. Bunger wasn't... That was not siege. No, I was definitely... I don't Dude, know about that. Yummy yeah, just never dork. stops playing this game. Dude, what do you mean? I'm just chilling. How does it feel to be the nerdiest rapper in the game? <laughs> That's actually a compliment. I'll take that. I'm the whitest... In best rapper, 5,000 hours plus on Rainbow Six Siege. <laughs> Stacking that bread, yeah, I got that cheese. 5K hours playing Rainbow Six Siege. <laughs> you can use that bar in your next rap song if you want to. I already wrote it down, thank you. What if I wrote a bar, like a double entendre? I like the spoon with my homie because his name is Soup. I like that. Just don't rhyme it with poop. I could. <laughs> All my fans comment sniping poop with laughing emojis, and I, it makes me cry a little bit. All my fans talk about how I like to spread their cheeks open when I post a video. Your parents? My my fans? <laughs> what? I heard parents. I've never I spread my parents open. I did a money spread on my parents and made them feel broke. Uh, that's rude, for honestly. Pay for that. Pay for that I gave him a $20 bill after. You guys see that new Oppenheimer movie? It was called Dopenheimer, I thought. Did you see the Barbie, uh, the Barbie 9-11 memes from Japan? They got mad about Oppenheimer. Dude, I heard about that. Yeah. Yeah, they got mad about Oppenheimer. Oh, from Tokyo or Japan? Yeah, or... so they saw it and they were like, that is disrespectful. They were like, this is the equivalent to what you're doing. And then it showed like a Barbie movie poster in front of a 9-11 picture. Did you see That's the one where it was Barbie it sitting funny. on Bin Laden's shoulder? And they were, they were saying like, yeah, how does it feel, America? This is what it would be like <laughs> if we made this movie. And I'm like, dude, I would pay so much money to go see that movie. Like, I don't think Japan realizes that we we make fun of 9-11 more than any other country. Yeah. <laughs> From Our tragedies are so funny to us, but like other countries, they don't have that culture at all. No, we're just fucked. <laughs> if Japan just made some like Barbie Bin Laden crossover movie, I'd fly to Tokyo to watch it. I'd, oh, yeah. I'd, I'd, be, I'd be on the red carpet. The real meme would be for Japan to send a third airplane. <laughs> a little promotional video of them just <laughs> bombing us. <laughs> <laughs> to promote a movie. I feel like if you put Bin Laden in any movie setting, that it would just make it a million times better and funnier. Like, imagine Bin Laden in Lord of the Rings. <laughs> what do you mean? I don't know. It would just go kind of hard. What would he be the Lord of? Lord of the Plains. <laughs> Lord of the Plains. <laughs> <laughs> so stupid. <laughs> He'd be the Lord of the Wings. Well, there you uh, go. That's pretty good. <laughs> You're going to win this round, big big girl. You're a big girl. <laughs> that is a big fucking girl. There you go, big girl. Shoot him. There you go. Oh, damn, damn, big girl. I'm such a big girl. <laughs> I think I blacked out there for a second. <laughs> big girls usually black out when doing anything physical. So. <laughs> Taking three <laughs> steps forward and screaming. I feel like Lizzo for a few seconds. You can make fun of her now because she's a piece of shit. Yes. I was gonna say, Which didn't she make somebody joke. like eat shrimp out of butthole or something weird? A banana. She was like fat shaming her her less like less weight than her co-workers. How do you fat shame when you look like a wrecking ball left on the side of the road? <laughs> like, <laughs> like the cleanup crew hasn't came and got it yet. She showed her ass in NBA game and she shows her ass on like national television, like in front of children. Her big fat oh, and yeah. gross ass. Yeah. It looks like like the whole town of Detroit just ran through her over and over again, and she showed everyone. She showed everyone the goods. Oh my God. Yeah, she looks like a bowl of pudding without the bowl. <laughs> without the bowl? 
looked like a Ziploc bag of cottage cheese was ran over by a semi truck. I don't even know what she looks like, dude. If Lizzo walked by me in public, I wouldn't even know who she is. I mean, I might feel like a you'd hear her coming before you saw her. It might register on the Richter scale, but I wouldn't know who she is. Like I couldn't identify her. Imagine Godzilla with titties. All right, done. <laughs> now she ain't sounding too bad. <laughs> yeah, I remember when a hockey commentator got in trouble because he was like, "Yeah, these boys are gonna have a lot of work tomorrow. They're gonna have to pack a Lizzo-sized lunch." And a bunch of oh people. Oh my <laughs> god! <laughs> that is savage. As I love that she's just like a unit of measurement now. <laughs> <laughs> in the future, they're gonna be like, "Yeah, this car weighs one Lizzo." I don't know. <laughs> there's like a, a measure of torque. Hey, you pulled about two and a half Lizzo's with this. Yeah, this you all fit about four Lizzo's in it. Move my whole house in this thing. A 46 footer. You know, people her size actually, when they have to get like uh, MRI scans and X-rays, have to go to the zoo to get the the bigger machines. <laughs> dude, dude, that is not real. It is real. That's, it is real. They don't fit in the normal sized Just machines. Just on a livestock scale. Dude, didn't they take Tammy from like a thousand pound sisters to uh, like some cattle thing? They weighed her on like a yeah, or was it livestock like, scale. <laughs> Stop scale. <laughs> <laughs> you think Lizzo has gone to Camastia, or I don't even know what the f be under yeah. there. That's uncharted territory right there. You need to get <sighs> Nathan Drake to look around in there. Nathan Drake, the Drake's guy from that is not Drake's first name. <laughs> <laughs> Drake's name isn't even Drake. Yeah, I was gonna say, isn't it Aubrey, Aubrey or something? Aubrey. I thought it was like Ishmael. Isn't it Ishmael? <laughs> Ishmael's a guy in the Bible. Ishmael like made out with Abraham and then they had the, the baby Isaac. And then he sacrificed him in front of uh, uh, Beezlebub. Beezlebub. Beezle. Beezle. Sorry. It's like sometimes you forget there's other people here who have to listen to you. <laughs> <laughs> I like catching big fat fish. Big old fat fish. Worst lyrics to a country song ever. Yeah, I don't. <laughs> <laughs> Feliz Navidad. All right, go blog. I got Yummy, it. how did you let that happen to me? Look at your big fat ass. I did it. I got it. Don't worry. Hey, <laughs> hey good job, monkey boy. I'm proud of you. Hey, buddy. Thank, hey, you. Buddy. Thank, thank you, sirs. Tokyo, what? what's up, man? What? How are you? What's up, man? Are Baby. you from Tokyo? No. Are you a fat white guy with a neck beard? <laughs> how big are your grandma's hands? Your grandma palm of basketball. If your grandma was going to play one-on-one -on -one with Shaquille O'Neal, how many points would she score? I think the better question is... How many points would Shaquille? No, actually, I was gonna say something, but that would be bad. Never mind. I'm muting you. Hey, <laughs> if Shaq, if your grandma, would she die? How blown open is your grandma? How blown open is your grandma? <laughs> you look like somebody put a firework in a frog. Nah, it looks more like if Vincent Van Gogh had a second go at his paintings. Vincent Van Went. <laughs> Vincent Vincent Car Stop. <laughs> It's a car stop. It's a car stop. <laughs> Yummy, I'm Rocky with the new album, by the way. Hi. Jimin from BTS is collaborating on my next song. <laughs> I don't even really know much about K-pop. You have Tokyo in your name. I feel like you're lying to me. <laughs> How big are Isaac oh Watts Gucci's? Dude, why don't you and Yummy just get a <laughs> hotel room and make out and have gay sex? <laughs> you can watch. Adam 22 type sh You can watch. Wait till you meet Adam 44. <laughs> He's twice as tall. <laughs> Two black guys f his wife. <laughs> All I gotta say to Adam 22 is that it's Adam and Eve, not uh, Eve and big black guy. <laughs> I feel like that's a that's a tweet somewhere on the internet right now. <laughs> yeah, like an unironic just old man. Yeah. Adam and Eve, not Adam Tyrone. <laughs> Why do you have Tokyo in your name? Old SoundCloud rapper name. Let's hear some bars. Uh-oh. They call me little pixie stick. Uh, I be bouncing up and down on your dad's dick. I oh, my fault. You, you got me killed. Yummy just said if you drop a hot freestyle, he'll give you a feature on his next album. Let's hear yeah, it. Yeah, I'll kiss you too. I'll send you a Michelle Obama feet pics. <laughs> I be sucking on the toes. Getting all these hoes, I'll be bouncing on my bros. Uh, I can tell you switched up. That was all I got, though. You switched up the beat. Yeah, that's usually what songs do. They change beats and tempo, you know? I thought you had to just like dudes to be in the industry. <laughs> this ain't no gay pro film scene, buddy. Now, however, what I might do is in our label interview, drug you you and then blackmail you for the rest of your career <laughs> so that you are forced to do everything that I tell you to do and you owe me a lot of money by the time that you're done being an artist under my label. This guy gets a music industry pretty good. <laughs> right, I'm going to hit this epic gamer spot. He's gonna get I'm going to shoot him in the back of the head. <laughs> Tokyo, give me your best joke. Are we talking family friendly or not family friendly? Why is it going to the N-word? It won't be the N-word, but it will be motivated. I'm going on vacation from the game chat.
<laughs> I muted him. It's <laughs> the most polite way to say, Sh shut the f*** up. I gotta go tie my shoes at home. Yeah. <laughs> Set a bar with somebody you don't like. <laughs> All my shoes are lined up and waiting to be tied at home, so I gotta go make sure I do that before they get impatient. <laughs> I got a mayonnaise delivery at 7 o'clock. I gotta go home. I'm sorry. <laughs> What's the worst excuse you guys have ever given someone to not hang out with them? I told this guy <laughs> I had to go pick up my grandpa's drugs and it was like 8 p.m. on a Wednesday. <laughs> Nothing is open. I think I just said, hey, my friends are over there. I'm gonna go talk to them instead. <laughs> Stands in the corner by himself very There's obviously. nobody else. <laughs> no one else in the room. <laughs> like a schizophrenic. I gotta go talk to the hat man in the other room. Sorry. <laughs> He's got a quest for me. Sorry, there's a nine foot tall figure on the ceiling over there. I gotta go say what's up. There's an exclamation mark above that guy's head. I gotta take care of that. <laughs> go make nasty. Go make nasty. Yeah. Yeah. Drop. Yeah. Drop Dude, McNasty, when did you get good at this game? I don't know. Check your left up there. Dude, tell your mom to shut up. You're recording. <laughs> what the f That's my hamster. Calm down. She's freaking out. They got no seed left. Damn, right, yummy. That back. was clean. You feed your hamster cum? <laughs> yeah. Nasty, don't. when's the last time you checked on your hamster? Um, about a week and a half ago. <laughs> the fact that you said um before that is already a problem. <laughs> like the fact that you didn't just off the rip, you like, I don't know, like an hour ago. I actually ago, just like... remembered I have a hamster. <laughs> Wait, I have a hamster? <laughs> your dog's in the other room just eating it. <laughs> oh, no, don't worry, guys. It's dead. I don't have to feed it. <laughs> you go check on him. He's hard as a rock. Yeah. It's just a big old burner. just out. What? I meant, what? I meant dead and hard, not hard alive or wrecked. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Hamster cock. No, he's good. He's just got a massive erection. He does this. He's got so much burn, he just passes out blood flow. <laughs> hamsters probably have crazy. They're the Chinese dwarf hamsters. They have big back end nuts. Yeah, Chinese, Chinese dwarf, dwarf hamsters. hamsters? That might be propaganda. I don't know, but I thought it was real. My, <laughs> I prefer Chinese midget hamster. Yeah. All I right. For Islamic giant hamsters. <laughs> Arabian pickled this. mice. That is a dish that you eat. Yeah, the hamster I have, she's actually pretty big. She? She's got balls. It's a teddy hamster. They're like bigger than normal. Titty hamster? Big old tits on my hamster. <laughs> Just like the normal human tits. Up. No fur on them whatsoever. You, Just, you guys think gorillas eat hamsters like chicken nuggets? <laughs> Just throwing them in their mouth, <laughs> tossing them back, dipping them in ranch. Yeah, it's because they're just smothering the little guy in the ranch. <laughs> the gorilla just grips a hamster, like squeezes the life out of it, just pulls ranch out of his ass and just cum dumps ranch all over him. Have you seen hamster? how uh, gorillas, how they like squeeze the banana and it, it goes right out the peel? What if they did that to the flesh of the hamster? <laughs> yeah. yeah, that's how they de-skin the hamster. Eating nothing but pure protein all in one bite. Yeah, I wonder what the macros are on a hamster. I feel like they got to taste kind of good. Oh, he's in the bathroom, Look McNasty. Yes, he has. Woo! Oh, you traded! Dup, dup. I feel like you, you laugh like a Russian dog would. <laughs> this is my dog, Concrete. Concrete, baby. That's Concrete Creep, baby! Oh, who is mowing? Who is mowing? He's giving his gaming PC Dude. a nice fade. <laughs> Dude, do they like come and mow moss off your bed sheets? Like, why is it so loud? Why do my bed sheets have moss on it? <laughs> I don't know. You live like an ogre yeah, in like that. You can. <laughs> Let's have a rock bed of dirt on it. <laughs> your bed's <laughs> growing moss again. You gotta come mow it. <laughs> He's like right outside my f window on my uh, my uh, <laughs> office. Do you actually find that funny, or did you forget the word for office? <laughs> I forgot the word. <laughs> it's time to feed Gramefius again. <laughs> Gramefius. <laughs> that is a Russian dog name. Yeah. the hug. Gramefius is hungry. Give him human skull. <laughs> <laughs> I get to feed him human parts. <laughs> that was not that funny. It's out of breath. You can actually walk into that door and breach it. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> There's the, the fade coming in again. <laughs> It's actually just his PC overheating. Yeah, he's just, he just has he's a PlayStation 4 on in the other room. <laughs> he's got a frozen pizza cooking on top of his computer right now. Dude, I had Shit. the most goblin meal last night after we got off from recording. I made a frozen pizza and I put cheddar cheese on top of it. I was like, you know what? F*** it, dude. I crushed up Doritos. And put it on top Damn. of the like like saying, high or something? Like I sh my brains out at the lake this morning. <laughs> like in the water? I was about <laughs> to do it in the water. Spray but... diary all over oh, fish. Dude. I've done that before. <laughs>
Oh, Sometimes you know. when nature's calling, you gotta re you gotta hang over the side yeah. of the boat and just fucking squirt it's them. The circle of life, you gotta replenish <laughs> the fish. Squirt the fish. That's gross. Hershey Kiss. Why'd you rhyme? We you get it. You have everything. an album out. I okay. know. I did it. I don't. Know, I didn't even realize. Sorry, man. <laughs> Squirting fish. Hershey Kiss. Where are they going? <laughs> <laughs> They're outside. I heard they mowing. <laughs> In your backyard. That's hard. All right. Just got a new car, Blarg. Okay. There's not a huge difference between people with schizophrenia and rappers who freestyle. I love yeah. Eminem. <laughs> what? <laughs> Eminem eating a Slim Jim with his friend Tim. Oh! Obamacita. Obamacita. <laughs> I just want to say that I got four kills that round. Good job, Look sushi man. Army, I went yeast mode. Slowly riz in a fridge with a towel. I got over shingles. It. I have shingles. <laughs> Rizzing a fridge with a towel over it? What? No, that's not what he said. <laughs> Who the fuck threw the spikes? Who was that? that was Probably an NFL this. player. Probably an NFL this. player. That's his wife. Tom Brady's gonna spike it and the game's over. Oh my god, he's kissing his son. He's making out with his son. <laughs> I love when you have awkward diarrhea mid recording. Introducing. Awkward diarrhea. Now what are we? So that made me talk about the awkward diarrhea chalupa. <laughs> but you have like a vibration in your voice when you said that. What would happen Walmart. if we gave gorillas big league chew? Let's do it. What if we chewed up 500 pounds of hubba bubba and dumped it on a gorilla? You think he could make it out of it? Yeah, he'd probably be able to figure it out. Well, gorillas are like 800 pounds, aren't they? What poundage of gum do you think the gorilla would have trouble getting out of? Probably 60 trillion tons. <laughs> it's the weight of the sun. I think we should just start putting gym equipment in the jungle and see if the gorillas no. start using it. No. Dude, I, if monkeys learned how to bench press, we'd, we'd be f That's what I'm saying, bro. <clears throat> Give them like a leg press. See how much a monkey can leg press. They don't need to do that. They already do that naturally. Yeah, but imagine that. Give them big bulls of creatine and just let them go to town in there. A monkey with like a f tricep pump would look insane. This, turned, it, this turned into a Joe Rogan podcast really quick. Yeah. <laughs> you think a, a gorilla could rip a whale in half? <laughs> a whale? 4-4 four, four overtime. My game just closed? <laughs> You'll get banned from on rank. We can't turn quick match. Did you just turn into Squidward? <laughs> One day Spongebob is gonna lose it and take a Ziploc bag and just reach through the window and put it over Squidward's big head and choke him to death. <laughs> and his tentacles are gonna pop out like balloons. <laughs> <laughs> we need some AI to voice over that scene. I told you this was f***ing coming, Squidward. <laughs> Come with me, Squidward. I love that all the SpongeBob AI things that they fed them just ended up turning into gay s*** with Patrick and SpongeBob. I haven't seen any of that. Yeah. I've, I've only seen, I mean, like, uh, Mr. Krabs sing Billie Jean, which was really good. I listened to the whole... No, it's not the clips. It's, like, the ones where they literally just let it, an AI, like, create infinite length episodes. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. We're... And it just keeps turning into... Oh, Squidward was like, July 30th, 2054, the fog is coming. July 30th, 2054. Yeah. Yeah, What's see. weird is when they get to that point, they get stuck on it. Like, they don't continue off of it. They just keep doing yeah, the same thing. Yeah, it's the future trying to tell us something. I like the one where SpongeBob <laughs> is like, Squidward, what's your last name? And it pans over and he's like, TESTICLES! <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I've seen that one. Editor, put it in. My butt. <laughs> it's gonna fucking boof. Smoking boof pack. I just fucking dude's ass. I need a mountain oyster, Bubba. Oh, this force is screaming at it, Bubba. Bubba! <laughs> I need a mountain oyster, Bubba. This shrimping ain't cutting it no more, Bubba. I want a big old bull nut, Bubba. Mountain oysters, Bubba. I, I need love them. absolutely unhinged forest bits. I prefer the jungle ones, but to each their own. <laughs> <laughs> Unhinged jungle bits. McNasty loves dad jokes. I do. <laughs> it's just, the, they're, they're so like unexpected. Oh, unexpected humor gets me. And font jokes. Font jokes? Trebucket. <laughs> you have the weirdest <laughs> little autistic joke? humor. <laughs> just say Trebucket and he'll giggle. <laughs> what is Trebucket? <laughs> I don't know what if jungle you know, bits you know. is or Trebucket. <laughs> it's a jungle bit! <laughs> Calm down. <laughs> Alright, that's it. I just left without the squad. Shit! Dude, the other day we were playing uh, Minecraft. No. Yeah, we were. Pretends to be shocked. And we were being so loud at 7 a.m. that the cops were called on us and they came to check on us and see what was going on. We're playing Minecraft. Uh, you should have got shot to death. It's like a old Skrillex beat. Nah, that's like an old Skrillex oh, yeah, beat. True. <laughs> Orangutan, orangutan. 
Banging orangutan. Banging orangutan. Kill infants. <laughs> and then the sounds of them dying. <laughs> so that's the sound of the pit bull barking as it rips them in half. <laughs> Your Dude. mother is so fat, I took a picture of her last year and it is still printing. Your mother is so stupid, she brought a spoon to the Super Bowl. <laughs> Your mother is so dumb. Xbox Live! <laughs> the first time I ever got grounded was because I spent $3 on my mom's credit card on a Yo Mama Joe cap. <laughs> I would have grounded you for life for that sh <laughs> At least you had some good jokes to say to your mom when you were angry for grounding you. I don't remember a single one. <laughs> your mom is so cheap, me. they banned her from the Dollar General. For <laughs> bringing a gun in. Your mom <laughs> is so cheap, she brought a pot to the Dollar Tree because she was trying to plant one. <laughs> I have nothing to say. Your mom is so plant I, I that she has up. leaves growing out of her. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't want to keep up with Mom Your joke. biological mother <laughs> is so good to look at, I want to procreate with her. Procreate. The curvature of your mother's bookers is so sublime. Bookus. Say an objective. Stop talking, please. Stop talking, please. Stop talking. I can't breathe. Good. You nervous? Yeah, I scared you a hot gun. Imagine, I'd actually kill myself. I'm no starting player! I haven't muted. Is he saying stuff? He called you a cock warrior. I am a cock warrior in God's <laughs> army. <laughs> yeah, dude. Everyone played BO2, bro. I am sick, muting dude. this guy. This guy yeah, is actually booby cancer. I have muted him a long time ago. I'm just gonna mute it. <laughs> oh, he hey! talks like a mosquito would talk. <laughs> yeah. I bet you drive a moped, boy. What? A bar stool? <laughs> moped. <laughs> I bet you drive a lot of bar stools at your house. You don't go to work. You don't go to work. Have you guys ever heard the term goonie? Cock? Isn't joking like you try to pull your till it's big or something? That's what the that's what the island boys do. I'm a joking boy. <laughs> Wait, joking is actually a thing? P stretching? You tie a big dumbbell to your wiener and you f f jump up and down. Me and the boys used to joke by the river. There's one guy who was my cousin. He used to catch bass with his bare hands. He had downs. He used to catch bass with his bare hands. We used to make him swim like a mile every every Wednesday. Joking you sound like you're full of shit. Oh, trust me, man. This story's true. I'm Theo Vaughn. You're more full of shit than my commode. What if humans were built like frogs and we had like poisonous scales on our back and we'd shoot them when we when we fin it climax yeah, just blast a load all over your bag big old fat dehydrated load so it's all sticky white <sighs> you're a gross guy you know that <laughs> i'm into the finer things in life like eating christmas ornaments who's ready for pumpkin spice season the two white bitches watching this video just went crazy <laughs> yummy you take one of my pumpkins home on your flight i got 12 of them you think i could garden. take a pumpkin as a carry-on item yeah i think so <laughs> If you were flying back to Halloween Town, maybe you could. It sounds like some Spirit Airlines bullshit. Like 15 pumpkins sitting next to you. Spirit Airlines and Spirit Halloween? There's a connection. I'm bringing, oh my I'm bringing god. A, uh, I'm bringing a Gord as my carry-on. If I have a kid and he's fat, I'm gonna change his name to Gord. <laughs> how do you know... Oh, you're gonna change his name. <laughs> well, I'll, well, the, I'll, name him, I'll name him Gordon, and then if he gets fat, I'll, I'll call him Gordon. It. Gord Ramsey. Ramsey's the fourth Gord. Fourth Gordon, 65. Four Gordons and 70 Ramseys ago. Everyone talks about Hell's Kitchen. I want to know what's going on in Hell's bathroom. <laughs> Big turds. Big old demon poopies. What? Dude, did I not shoot this guy like five times? I had to rip a f monkey's neck off. If I ever get a terminal illness, I'm gonna saw a horse's head off with a chainsaw. And then eat it on live leak. I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna, well, I'm gonna I do it on Twitter. Yeah, well, I horse's legs, so... I can take you there in Toronto. It sounds like a fake place, but they got horse leg and fried pig ears. You can eat horse? You can eat anything you want yeah. to. Yeah. Anything is deep edible. Fried, you can eat deep fried pig ears. They're working animals. Why would It wouldn't even be tender at all. Like, what's working the point? Working animals. I've never seen one employed personally, but... Bojack Horseman? You never seen a working salmon? What the f*** are you talking about? I don't you know. ain't never been to a McDonald's? and the horse is in the drive through giving you a burger? <laughs> oh my god, the sound bug. Me when I see a cricket? <laughs> you want me to direct me how to play? Left. What do I Back, do? Back, left, there. Forward, left, downstairs, downstairs, downstairs. Okay, aim in. Right. Okay, nice. One more. How do you know that? Right, bar down. No, right, 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 right. The bar's on fire. The bar's on fire. 
Mr. McDonald? I've never heard somebody use the non-plural of McDonald's. I've heard that somebody is just McDonald's? Say, is, is this McDonald's? What's that, Mr. McDonald? You guys call that McDonald's in your country? In my country, we call it Mackey, Spagnol, Flippy, Floppy, Flippy, Zippy, Doobies. <laughs> 14 syllables. <laughs> you guys want to make a country album together? Hell no. yeah. Yeah, we should make a country album. I'm parked out by the lake. Yeah, I'm parked out by the lake. That's too slow. If you're wondering where I'm at, I'm out parked by the lake. I've never heard the song about the lake. No, he's parked out by the lake. It's not just the lake. He's parked out by it. <clears throat> Isn't it like uh, parked out by the lake something miles Santa Fe or some shit? Yeah. Does Santa Fe have lakes? I feel like Santa Fe doesn't have lakes. Well, it's miles from Santa Fe. I've been 80 miles, miles mile. from Santa Fe. 64 light years from Santa Fe. <laughs> I'm out parked on the seventh quadrant of space. <laughs> Eight I'm million miles from Santa Fe. Fe. <laughs> Thanks for watching the video. If Thanks you for enjoyed, Thanks for please sh all over that like button. Take a big old shit on it! <laughs>